Today we're going to work on measurement and we're going to convert some measurement units. This is with the customary system and these are units of length. All right, so we have yards to feet and yards to inches. So let's look at a couple simple problems. So five yards equals how many feet? If you'll notice yards, yards is your larger unit than the feet, feet is smaller. And yards to inches, this is also a larger to a smaller unit. So both of these are going from larger to smaller. We know we're going to multiply, okay? So let's look at the first example, yards to feet. Yards to feet, that is, there are three feet in one yard. So it's simple as that. We're gonna multiply three times five, and that's it. 15 feet are in five yards. All right, so let's look at this next one. The next one is yards to inches, yards to inches. So we have 36 inches in one yard. We wanna know how many inches are in four yards. So we're gonna multiply times four. So when you multiply times four, just do your multiplication and get your answer of 144 inches. So four yards equals 144 inches. All right, so if you have a decimal number, 6.3 yards, and you're converting that to feet, you're still moving from yards to feet. That's larger to smaller. You're gonna multiply. So you will multiply 6.3 times what? Well, we're moving from yards to feet, so we're gonna say times three and multiply. One space over, one space over, and 6.3 yards equals 18 and 9 tenths feet, okay? All right, so let's look at this one with a fraction. Two and a half yards equals blank inches. All right, so going yards to inches, we're gonna multiply two and a half times 36. Now, um, it's helpful to know that two and a half means two and five tenths. So 36 times 2.5. Now, so two and a half yards equals 90 inches. Yeah. So when we change from Units of length from a larger unit to a smaller unit always multiply.